Right now, it's time to show you some of this morning's headlines. USA Today says an Iraq war veteran in Ohio is fighting to keep his therapy ducks. Darren Welker owns 14 of the fowl. He says they help his back injury and his post-traumatic stress. But the village of West Lafayette says the ducks violate an ordinance banning farm animals. Welker has been cited with a misdemeanor while he goes to court Wednesday. The Boston Globe says exercise can count on the impact of sitting all day at work. A study out this morning warns Prolonged sitting increases blood pressure and cholesterol, but working out regularly can erase those side effects. All right. The Wall Street Journal says Sony's Walkman is making a comeback. Oh, yeah. This one is a little different from the original cassette player. It costs, get this, $700 and Whoa. carries 128 gigabytes of storage. The device is carved from a block of expensive aluminum. Sony told its designers to create a good product without worrying about the cost. Mission accomplished. Seven hundred yes. bucks. Yes. Okay. My goodness. And the Seattle PI says a West Virginia teenager with cystic fibrosis got a chance to play alongside a big soccer star. The Make-A-Wish Foundation arranged for Xander Bailey to play with his hero. That would be Clint Dempsey on Saturday as a member of the Seattle Sounders, of course. Dempsey, as you may recall, was also captain of the Team USA at the World Cup. He came here to talk about it. They played a friendly game against an English team. Bailey didn't score, but that didn't seem to matter to him or anybody else who was cheering him on. Oh, that's great. We like Clint Dempsey. Very much. Very much.